Good morning, Librans. It is bright and early, 6 a.m. You're my first reading of the day. This is the air sign readings. All right, I have Tarot the Mystical Moments for the main deck. I have Golden Art Nouveau Tarot for the clarifying deck, and the links to these decks can be found down below in the description box. So I have an Ace of Wands and a Two of Pentacles reverse coming in here. Now, of course, Ace of Wands just could be you, um, maybe positive could be talking to somebody new and all of that but this ace of wands only because it's like in a in a book in a fairy tale i always feel but not necessarily in the ground it could be flirtation it's it could be a very cute energy um but then we have a six of swords reverse and a four of pentacles reverse and the two of pentacles reverse is resistance to moving on so for some of you librans right this energy could be somebody wanting an, another go so it's it's very difficult to move on look at that three of swords there your energy is king of pentacles reverse so let's see what's going on let's let's see libra sun moon rising venus libra if you are a libra know a libra feel like being a libra librans i'm glad you're here you could be a libra and this resonates you could be dealing with a libra it could resonate as the main story and libra can be the cross watcher this reading could be about a libra or for libra take it as it resonates Collect the messages for my lovely Librans. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. All right, Libra. What is the story that needs to come out today for my lovely Librans? Right there. Ace of Swords, reverse. Wow. Let me move this down, guys. I'll try to. Sorry. It's just kind of not moving. Ace of Swords, reverse going on here. One second, because this is really bothering me. Because the ring light's in it. Everything's just kind of... I don't know why I cannot bend this. I just don't want to break it and not be able to do your reading. Huh. All right. Ace of Swords reverse. What's influencing the Ace of Swords reverse? What's influencing the Ace of Swords reverse? The Five of Wands. I feel like somebody felt like they got played. And I, the thing is, is I feel like the attraction was really strong here. But an Ace of Swords reverse is overthinking. Um, maybe somebody's thinking too hard, honestly. What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? The High Priestess. Is this a newer connection? And it could be both. Some of you Librans, this could be about a newer connection, but this could also be about an older connection watching what you're doing. What's what's in the past? What's in the past? The Page of Cups. I like that. I like that. The Page of Cups is a very cute energy. It's kind of flirtatious. It's not I like you. No, I like you. The energy's there, but why is somebody really hiding their feelings? This, I mean, the high priestess, she's hiding her feelings behind not speaking on them. And you got the Scorpio King of Cups, the Piscean Moon, and of course the Cancer. It feels like somebody's hiding their heart. What's on your mind? What's on Libran's mind? The Seven of Wands, ready to fight for this. See, with love. I'm starting to feel like somebody's hiding their emotions from you. What's in the near future? I've, Ace of Swords Reverse can be a card of overthinking. Five of Wands, it's like, <clears throat> it just feels like they're overthinking something. Near future for Libra. The Strength Reverse, Leo Energy. But then you have the Fool and the Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this is what you want. And they're not giving it to you. But Strength Reverse, maybe you're, maybe you're dealing with a Leo, honestly. Um... And you might step back and that's going to have them come forward. All right. What is this Ace of Swords reverse center of the reading? Ace of Swords reverse. And it, Ace of Swords reverse can also be, I just really get somebody's keeping their feelings secret. I, I do. Because that can be a secret card too. What's the Ace of Swords reverse center of the reading? Yeah, Page of Wands. I feel like this is what they want. I feel like there's two people, there's a strong connection, there's a lot of flirtation. I feel like this person has a lot of feelings, but yet we're not speaking on them. May, are they in another connection? Could that be it? Influencing energies of five of wands. 
why the five of wands and the king of swords king of swords upright now kings can be married and of course libra you're the queen of swords so you got the king and queen of swords so you do have a true pair going on here but i king of swords also can hide their feelings and I really feel like I'm reading for someone, if this person's attached to someone or not, or if you're attached to someone or not, I feel like this person doesn't share their feelings easily. That's the king of swords. It doesn't mean they don't have them. They do. They, they have a hard time expressing how they feel. Why the king of swords on the five of wands? I feel like somebody's overthinking. And a five of wands again. I feel like somebody's really overthinking the approach. They're thinking if, if you don't reciprocate. They're thinking if, you, you know... They're overthinking. High Priestess, reason for the reading. Queen of Pentacles, reverse. Queen of Pentacles, reverse can be a very nervous energy. And if this is going down in the workplace, this makes a lot of sense because maybe with the Five of Wands, clarifying the Five of Wands and the King of Swords, is this your boss? Is this somebody higher and they don't want other people to know? Because an Ace of Swords, reverse can be a secret card. There's, there's a quietness about this reading. So Queen of Pentacles reverse and the High Priestess. Why is that? And this, look at this, a lot of true pair going on. Queen and King of Pentacles. We have the Queen and King of Cups. We have the Queen and King of Swords. Interesting. I just, I really feel like somebody wants to give to this, but they're afraid. Page of Cups in the past. Nine of Wands. This is a card of fear, Nine of Wands. See how he's holding back his Page of Wands? Did I say Page of Wands in the past? I think I did. Page of Wands is here, but it's a Page of Cups. But somebody's holding back their 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 energy, but they're holding on to this Page of Wands. I feel like due to fear, it, it feels like a secret type of connection. Why the Nine of Wands and the Page of Cups? And yeah, waiting, Three of Wands waiting for the right time i feel like there let's just say i feel like there's a libra that was ready now for this and then whoever you're dealing with knows that it's right they are very attracted they're they know it's right on every level but why are they waiting for the right time it's like they're afraid of people finding out seven of wands on your mind leo energy and the, i Leo, I feel like there's a Libra, like, I don't care. Let's just, let's do this. Seven of Wands on Libra's mind. Seven of Wands. Look at the symmetry. Five of Wands clarifies a Five of Wands. Seven of Wands is clarifying a Seven of Wands. Somebody's ready to fight for this. Somebody's ready to defend this. And somebody else is keeping it a secret. Seven of Wands, Seven of Wands on Libra, but a Six of Cups reverse. I, f I do feel like somebody's attached, but they know somebody's ending something. Interesting. Scorpio, Six of Cups, Reverse. Give me another card there, please. And a Page of Cups. There's, there is an ending, because we have a Nine of Wands. Tens represent an ending happening in a full cycle. You have the two fives, that equals the Ten of Wands there. Nine, Ten of Wands. I just feel like there's somebody came into somebody else's life when something else was ending. And I feel like they're, from my perspective, there's a Libra who's ready for this. They're attracted to this person, but you, you, you were, I feel like you've been patient, but then you have a strength reverse. Is this them leaving something or is this you walk stepping back? Strength reverse Leo energy. It's like, also, because there's so much Leo, and if you're dealing with a Leo, I feel like there's a Leo who can't hold themselves back anymore. Seven, strength reverse, near future. Yeah, hermit reverse is somebody coming back, somebody, and if, if you did step back, this person's gonna come back quick. But I do feel like a hermit reverse is an enlightening moment. When he's upright, he's searching for his star. It's an introspective card, searching for someone. And I feel like this person found what they were looking for. So when it's a hermit reverse, it's saying, hey, I know what it is I'm looking for. I'm not going to hold myself back. But I do feel two of swords and an ace of cups to protect a Lib yourself. You might be in your energy right now and not really speaking to them, but you still have a lot of emotion. 
And you may not be sure if they were on the same page. They definitely were. Once again, the Ten of Swords and the Four of Wands reverse. I do feel like they're ending something for something new because now you have a Ten of Pentacles. It's really beautiful, strong connection, but somebody was hiding their feelings, but they don't want to hide them anymore. All right, Libra, have a great rest of your week or at least start your weekend and take care.